real quick for any of you who have not seen the character creation on this it's pretty simple you got male you got female uh, skin color um, I'm white as a ghost so we're just gonna go with that hair you have different styles nothing really major I hope they add some more I think I'll go with this uh, hair color same as usual I'm going green then you just slap your name in and then that's it then you go over here single player or you want to host a server or join a server single player is what I'm going to do today and a new world we're just going to go with normal medium settings and we're good to go start game all right we're in the game we're going to head to the starter island I call it the starter island it's just basically just where everybody spawns unless you do random uh earth spawn which I do not suggest doing unless you're just wanting to play hardcore then go for it because you're gonna end up here somewhere or really far away from anything good that water tower is actually where I like to build when I first start I like building around it it's just something different than everybody else uh, but the only problem is when you're closer to that they like to raid you a little more frequently but since this is my first time actually putting Sunken Land on my channel, I am going to use the Starter Island. We're going to collect what we need to, and then we're going to get building what I planned, which would be that tower. And I'm going to show you everything that starts with the beginning of the game. Alright, grab this. The blueprint is actually something new that they put in here on a 2.0 update I believe so that's actually kind of nice to have something to start with I need to collect some more wood and build a platform because I need to have a place to put storage because I'm going to have to collect a lot and I mean a lot of wood so I don't have to keep taking breaks during my build I'm going to collect some scrap metal too because I do want to get my base at least uh, built in scrap metal. That way it's stronger in case some enemy tries to maul talk me or something like that. I could just do the whole thing in metal, but that's going to take a lot longer to gather the materials and eh, it's, not, it's not worth it for what I'm going to build. It's going to be hard for them to reach me anyways once I get started. I do um, need to collect some cloth and things like that, so I'm going to go underwater get a couple of those also. Alright, this should be enough to get on to what I need to start it. Let's get up here. nice thing about this part is, you ain't got a Skyrim it to get up, but you can just walk. Nice leisurely stroll up the rocks. And this is where I'm going to start up here. Now... When I do this, though, I'm going to place this platform, but I'm not going to place it where my main build's going to be. I'm going to put it down here, just out of the way, because I want to be able to just come here, get the supplies, go back up, and keep going. And then when it's done, it's not in the way of anything I need to do. So let's get that built. I'm almost always hitting random buttons. He's... So you'll probably see me do that quite a lot. Here we go. Build the chest. We're going to need a couple of them, so I'm just going to build as many as I can with what, this, what I got. And here. Boom. Four should do it. That'll work good. Now we're just going to go get collecting. I'm not going to put you through that, so you're just going to get a little montage, and we'll be right back. guys we're back 
and it's enough light i think we can get started let's see i i'm hitting all the wrong buttons but whatever okay we need a platform to start with i want to get a little higher up than this but i want to get right into the rock maybe let's see i think that'll be the spot i want right there all right yeah we'll work with that and they don't need to be super long i think this is wide enough because i can always build up higher once i need to which i'm going to have a second floor that's a definite but i don't think i'll go farther than that yeah i'll put these here because i can build a wall up around these rocks and this will be where my tower probably goes up in the air i'm not going to put it into the center all right let's grab some more wood as you can see i stocked up i didn't want us to have to keep coming back over and over again i thought about um like i said earlier making my base in metal which i did collect a decent amount of metal also but they're not going to be able to get me that well up here once i get a uh guard door around and everything yeah they're going to be in trouble all right now i need I should have left a hole right here because I would have liked to have the entrance like right here and some stairs going up. Uh, I got a little gung-ho about that, didn't I? Should I do that? Yeah, let's uh do that real quick. Goodness. There. Um, let's put this here. Demolish. Well, I'm demolishing. Why aren't you demolishing? There we go. Yes, I want to destroy this one perfect now the stairs come on <laughs> I have a bad habit of remembering which one I need to be where all right stairs can go right here so I just don't like being able not to see it. there we go now I can see it better right there perfect and I can put a door well a door or something right there it's probably just going to be the gate that I put up that blocks that half but that's perfect all right now need the walls there's gonna be plenty of windows because I want to see what's coming at me and definitely gonna have a lot to do with these directions Every four corners is going to have one. I'll put one in the middle. Directly across. This ain't right in the middle, is it? Oh, well. You know what? We'll do this. Because I like things a little more symmetrical. I'm not perfect, but, you know, I'd like to have at least close to something. All right. Let me get this here. All right this and this all right now we have the basic start of everything now to lay some posts down and then all right uh Real quick, need to put those here because that's where my tower is going to go up, right here. Uh, yep, I think that's as high as I want it. Uh, maybe I should go higher? No, I think that's good enough. Let me see once I got the second floor on and what it looks like. I need, need to put the, the ceiling on real quick. I gotta put one of these here i'm gonna make sure i do that real quick because i have a habit of double hitting buttons and <laughs> that'll just end up defeating the purpose of everything i want it'll be a waste of wood all right now i need to slap the ladder in here we go all right now i'm just gonna repeat the pot process of 
that opening all the way up and then we'll see if we need to make it higher or not. Alright, um, we have these on here, and I don't know. I think that's good enough height, but once I got that floor on, the heck, we'll slap one more on for the heck of it. Alright, that's a good enough height, I believe. I do need to put the walls up around it because I do not want a situation where I'm not able to install the walls. Let's see, I'm going to put a wall here, a wall here, and a wall here. I'll leave this open because I'm going to put a doorway here, but let's get the rest of this done real quick. Alright guys, um, something weird, it's not letting me put the, uh, walls on all four corners of some of these, like here and here, which is not a big problem as long as I have the areas I want, but still, it's kind of weird. Um, hopefully that's something they fix in the future. I don't know why it's doing that, but it definitely kind of puts a damper on my day, at least a little bit. All right, get the door on. And we got the door in. And my tower is started. No, the tower is not done. It needs more. I'm going to grab some more wood real quick. Now it looks like I got some enemies wanting to come up with an owl and interrupt my building. So I'm going to have to take care of that real quick. Uh, gonna need a weapon. Put you on and a bow. I need rope. Do I have some cloth? Yes. Alright. We're gonna make this a uh, bow. And then make some arrows. Oof. <laughs> All that wood I went through. Oh well. Gotta survive. Don't think I'm gonna be able to get him from here. I'm not that good of a shot. Yeah. Not even close. Alright. Make sure they're not around any other part of the base that can get me from behind. Oh, there they are. Off of my stuff, bitches. There we go. I gotta get this down packed a little bit. Oh. Really? Hold still so I can shoot you. There we go. I'm liking this bow and arrow more and more. Come on, headshot. Aw. Oh, come on, I need to get this guy. Hey, I'm over here. Yep. Come on. A little closer. Ah, see what these douchebags got. Uh, I can use that stuff later on. Really? A little bit of cloth? You ain't worth a dang. What about you? A little tiny bit of cloth. Again. Really wasn't worth it, but okay. But it is what it is. Let's get up here and um, finish the power. 
I had to switch that ladder around if you're wondering because I couldn't open the door and shut it and go in because of the way I had the ladder. I was going to leave that out, but honestly, y'all would have figured it out eventually. All right, let's finish this tower. We're going to throw some flooring down in each corner. Then we're going to throw some corners in like this. So we have plenty of room to walk around on. Then I need to add four more posts. All right, then I'm gonna end up running out of wood, but I think I might be able to at least finish the, the roof. I want to slap on this thing real quick. Now there's a couple different roofs. I kind of like that. Let's see how this looks. Yeah, that's neat. I like that. I'm gonna go with that. I like it open like that. All right, then I need doorways. All right, so real quick, before I slap it in, I'm gonna put doorways in all the way around because I want as much light to get out as possible. I don't need to actually put a door in, just the doorway itself. And it looks like it's gonna pull one of them things where it's not letting me put it in where I need to, which is really weird. I'm not sure what's going on. Let me try with a window, see if it does it. I don't mind it. I just would have liked to had, you know, all four of those like that. No? Okay. Well, I can think of something, but that's not exactly the way I wanted it. I'm not sure what's going on with the game where it won't let you put things where you need it. It's kind of odd. It's probably just some glitch they need to fix further on down the line, which it ain't going to affect what I'm going to be able to do. It's just aesthetically I would like it to be complete. All right, now I just need a fence around the wall so I don't fall off. And I need more wood. Be right back. All right, back at it. I'm going to put one of these here, one of these here, and one of these here. Then we're going to put the 45s in. Okay, that's done. Now, there is a little trick that I thought of, and it's worked for me so far, so we're going to stick with it. And I need more supply chests, basically. I need one here. I need one here. You'll see why I'd put these here in just a second. And one here. All right. Now let's close that. Now, as you can see, you can't see over this mid wall very well, right? Well, look. Now I can see perfectly. And there's nothing they can reach that far up here to get me. But I can reach them go, going down a lot easier. Because, think about it. I got a good shot right at whoever's coming up. I can get them here and get over here to my next box, get them from here to here. So it, I think it'll work out pretty good. Wasted an arrow for that, but whatever. So next on the list is lighting. Obviously, we're going to need that to basically bring this whole thing together. And what we're going to use is fish bowls and hanging lanterns. First, we're going to lay these down out of the way. So I'm going to put one on each corner real quick. Here, 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 and here. This is not enough light. This is just the start of everything. Since this area is more open, we're just going to use it to put more lights down. And yes, I'm blocking these off with lights too. Because the more light, the better. So I want it bright as possible. I'm out of wood. Be right back. All right, back at it again. Let's see if we can get that there. And then that will make enough light just right there. Then I'm going to put one by each of these. Like I said, I want to get this thing really bright. There's one there. I could put one on each side, but I'm not going to go super overkill. All right, guys. This is what I want to go for so far. It doesn't look that pretty up close, but if we go down, 
we're gonna just take a shortcut and deal with the damage. It gives off a pretty good amount of light. So what I'm gonna do is try to swim over there real fast. Awesome guys, look. That's the giving you the idea of what I had. We can see that tower from a decent distance away and I think we're gonna be able to see it when it's really dark from the really far islands also. All right, we're gonna get back over and we're gonna finish building the rest of the, the house. Okay, first things first, I'm going to take everything from these and put them into some chests I'm gonna put up here real quick. So that way I can get working on the rest of it and get that destroyed before the next attack. got everything transferred and I need to just grab these couple little boxes for where I demolished everything that would come in handy I'm sure and we're gonna get started on the defensive walls now I'm gonna put a gate right here or it might be easier to put it here and go up but no we're gonna put the gate right here all right we're gonna go metal this is why this is why I saved all my metal and I'm hoping this will let me come out right about here. Nope. Right there. Far as ways I can get. That'll work. So I don't mind it because it's going to be up higher than everything else. But it'll block them from being able to get in. This is where all the fun stuff happens. Ah, come on. I got to keep falling. Alright. So basically I need to get everything lined up. And we're going to... I did cover up the two windows, but I'm not that worried about it. I just wanted to make sure everything is like locked down. I used a barricade here to fill in the gaps and one over here to fill in that little bit of gap that was there. But doors open really good. I got plenty of room to get in and out. That shuts. Got my way up here. See, those two windows are covered, but all my other windows are open just fine. And I'm going to take you a tour around the rest of the building. Plus, I have a good shield in case I get shot at while I'm up here. But I'm going to probably put another floor in here before I'm done. Which I think I will, just for the heck of it. But here's the walls right here. I put barricades right there just to fill in the gap. Because I thought it looked better. It really didn't need to be done because they're not going to be able to climb up here anyway. And if they can throw a Molotov... It's going to be hitting the barricade. So it's no big problem. Here didn't need any. This is a sheer cliff. They're not making up it. If they do, well, I'm going to hit them from the windows. But I think that covers all that pretty well. 
I got a pretty good fortified base. And I got my tower. It's not 100% the way I planned it, but you gotta roll with the punches and go with what you can. All right, let's slap some windows in real quick. All right, all the windows are in. I did end up slapping windows over the ones that are covered just because I, I don't know, just thought it looked better. All right, I need me to put a workbench in. Hopefully I have enough to actually do that. Is that on here? No, it's on here, isn't it? Yeah, awesome, I do it. Oh, that's a grill. What am I doing? I need a workbench. Research, I need to grab components. Luckily, I do have plenty of those. At least for what I need. I gotta go label these chests so I know which one is which, though, because Lord knows I have a terrible memory. Alright, let's get back to here. Build this. Because we're gonna need you. Uh, put you in a corner where you can't really see anything. And right here. I think that'll work. And I do need a bed. Because I do not have... A sleeping bed in is what's here humble sofa I don't need any of that right now I just need the important things cloth is here on it yes all right get back here put my bed down I'll put that over here out of the way yeah put it right next to barbed wire that'll be a good way to wake up in the morning all right, now I got a bed, so if I die when I'm going out to get some more supplies, at least I can get back to my own base. And I think we're pretty well secure. I do need some light in here real quick, though. Because it's about to get dark, and it's going to be a pain without light. And we'll go with standing torches for in here. Put one right here. One right here. And then I'm going to need some for going in and out, maybe. At least I can see under here. And then I got that bonfire right there. So, yeah, we'll just leave that there. I'm not going to destroy it. And we'll fill it when we have to. I need somewhere to warm up while I'm running out of the water. And it'll be close, so that'll work. All right, let's build the purifier while I have... The materials to do so before I have to go back out. I'll get everything done, at least that'll keep me alive, that I really need for now, before I go back out to get more supplies. Because I'm not going to put you all through watching that again. Hold still, come on. Right there. Alright, what else? Alright, I do need wood shells and stuff that way you don't have to keep putting it in the boxes it'll be a better place to store things i think and i put that rare real quick i'm going to uh build some wood shelving and metal racks up here for now at least that way i have them and i can have a better place to store things Put them right here. All right, I'll put these right here. Three should be good enough, maybe. No, not four, just to be safe. Because I do go through a lot of wood. And then metal racks, I can build four of those. I should have enough to do that. I'll put those right across here. Nope, I'll end up for three. Okay, well, that's fine. Ain't a big deal. Just take what little I have left. Toss them in here. Alright, that takes care of that. I'll be right back when there's some daylight.
Hey y'all, I'm back. I think we're going to end the video here today. I've done collected everything I needed to for the moment, but I do got to do a lot more. Like, I got to refill my stock of scrap and wood and collect more things. I did get some cool stuff while I was out. There was some pants, but unfortunately they were damaged, so all I can use them for is armor. I made a little piece of armor for myself, but I didn't have any more leather. I'm going to have to collect that also. But the best thing of the whole day is Ducky got a pedestal to sit on under his light. This is my current achievement for the whole video. You just don't know how great Ducky is. And now you get to see him in all his glory on his pedestal. Yes, it's an urn, but now it's a pedestal because that's what I want to use it for. <laughs> and I got this painting, which I think is pretty cool. We got a lot accomplished, though. We got a tower, Flash Lighthouse, that we can see from all the way around. We got a fortress now that I don't think anybody in this game, at least when it comes to the NPCs, is going to be able to raid. I think we're doing really good. This place is a fortress now. It ended up being more than I planned. I originally just planned a small building with a tower to look over everything. And what I end up with, the fortress of Ducky. So next time, I hope we get to do a little bit more, maybe increase our fortress's walls around the whole entire island, or go a little more heavy with the exploring and collecting things instead of me just doing building like I am but I hope y'all enjoyed this and I hope to see you next time don't forget to like and subscribe and please leave a comment let me know what you think of this whole build I know it's probably ugly as sin but it's functional and it'll do the job also what would you like me to do next episode if I do another episode at all because you know if nobody likes this what's the point well Honestly, I don't care because I'll probably still do it because I like this game and it's fun. I love building stuff. But anyway, I'll see y'all next time. Cluster Duck out.